the Speaker, House of Representatives, Femi Bajabiamila, says he will not sign the 2021 appropriation bill presently before the National Assembly if provisions were not made for the compensation of the families of victims of police brutality. Bajabiamila also says he would not sign the budget if implementation of the agreement between the Academic Staff Union of Universities, ASU, and the federal government is not captured in the budget. Both the Speaker of the House and President of the Senate signed bills passed by the National Assembly before they are transmitted to the President for assent. In his opening remarks at plenary on Tuesday, the Speaker notes that the NSAS protests have gotten more serious with pockets of violence in parts of the country. We will not sign off on a budget that does not meet the reasonable demands of the ASU, to which government has already acceded. There is no better time to rethink the system of funding for higher education in Nigeria. The current system does a great disservice to our children and our country, and we must commit to changing it so that we can free our institutions of higher learning to be citadels where innovation thrives and excellence is a given. With my colleagues in the House of Representatives, I will visit over the next week some of the families of those who have lost loved ones to police brutality. And when we come back, we will work together to honor the memory of those who we have lost. The House of Representatives will pass an electoral reform bill in time for the next generation elections so that we may continue to improve the process of electing our political representatives at all levels. I will support the amendment of the Constitution to ensure that the provisions of fundamental human rights have teeth resource control is dealt with equitably, and that the next generation of Nigerians, does not, Nigerians will not inherit evident dysfunctions of our current system.